Welcome back to the morning show here on Arise News. Joining us now is our in-house analyst, Ikenna Kingsley, with stories trending around the world. Hi, Ikenna. Hey, guys. Hi, how are you guys Ikenna. doing? Ikenna, we're good. Okay. Thank God it's Friday. Yeah, yeah and it's actually it's Friday. happy Salah to all yes. our Muslim brothers yeah. and sisters. Yeah. Definitely. They and this, frosting today. this weekend will be turned. I can feel it. Yeah. <laughs> I feel it. Everybody is on holiday apart from us. Well, it's yeah, fine. we, like we, we love it. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> okay, what's trending? Okay, Dominic Fontana, popularly known as DJ Fontana, the last remaining member of Elvis Presley's original group, has passed away. His death was confirmed by his son, David, who said Mr. Fontana had been in poor health since breaking his hip in the fall last year. Mr. Fontana was the first drummer in Presley's band and played with him for 14 years and backed Presley on more than 450 recordings. He was 87 years old. Oh, that mm -hmm. first picture of him looked like Arnold Schwarzenegger initially. <laughs> that, do you see, does anybody see what I'm seeing? Maybe not, but Maybe yeah. the heck, huh? Yeah. Well, I don't, no, I don't see it. <laughs> no, you don't. Well, but, would, would you consider oh. this like um, a sad news? He's 87. I feel like, well, he's lived a life. Well, don't you mm. think? Yeah, but I mean, at, at any age, it's just sad that somebody is gone. Sad. And you yeah. know, you're not going to see them again, so. Yeah, yeah and um, he, he died in his sleep. Family. So I guess he died peacefully. Yeah. Yes. I, yeah. I mean, not like I like, but I like hearing when old, that old people died in their sleep. It yeah. just shows that they didn't really go yeah. through much pain. I uh, hope. A lot of them actually pray to go yes, that way. just go peacefully. Mm -hmm. Yeah, no drama. Anyway, what else is trending? Okay. Helen Winslow Jr. has been arrested for kidnapping and rape. He faces life in prison. Officials say Winslow is being charged with nine criminal charges, including kidnapping with intent to commit rape, forcible rape and sodomy, burglary, indecent exposure, and more. If convicted on all charges, he faces life in prison. The ex-NFL star was arrested for by the Sheriff Major Crimes Division at 1.05 p.m. on Thursday. Wow. Yeah. Those are a lot of charges, by... aren't they? That's a lot. A yeah, lot. that's a lot. The NFL will definitely not be happy with this. Mm -hmm. Yeah, definitely that, not like be... their ex-player. You're supposed to be like a role model to people out there that right. are trying to get into the game, and you're being held for rape and burglary. I mean, it's messed up. Yeah, Master. it's not even the role model thing. Every time people bring up this role model thing, I always just feel the need to speak. <laughs> is the, the mere fact that you're dealing with other humans, you should not kidnap, sure. you should not try to rape, you should not do anything. Not because you're a role model, just because you're human yeah, and they're sure. human as well. Yeah. So um, regardless of him being a role model, he should not, again, all these are alleged, right? Like they're not, are they confirmed? They're confirmed, like, they, like he has like a list of um, charges against him and wow. he's saying, the only thing he can actually defend is saying that he didn't like, you know, go into the house, like not like a burglary attempt or something like that, but mm. he has not come out to say, talk about the other, you know, stuff charges. that, mm. charges that are like against him and all that. So I don't yeah. know, man, I just, it's messed well, up. It's messed up. Oh well, we'll be following the story. Mm -hmm. yeah, what definitely. else is trending? Okay, despite rumors surrounding his marriage, a rep for Bill Cosby is saying he and his wife of 54 years are not divorcing. The rumor started popping up following Cosby's assault conviction. But his rep told reporters that not only are, they rum are, are the rumors false, but Camille is standing by her man and continues to live in their freely home. Even though he's facing jail time, Cosby maintains his innocence and says he is planning to appeal. Yeah. Okay, mm. well, another Well, I know Cos day, Cosby's case Cosby is like update. a very disappointing one. You know, like I grew up watching this guy and um, next thing he's being held for, you know, sexual assault and all kind yeah. of stuff. Yeah, we've spoken about the case a lot here on the show, but I think what's interesting is the fact that his wife is actually sticking by his side. Yeah. Because a lot of pe women, because just because of the type of charges, they were against women. So if, if these charges are actually true, it means he was actually very, um, yeah, wasn't very loyal, was he? It's a lot of infidelity. No, he wasn't loyal, if, if that If those charges are true, and are she's true. still yeah. choosing but to stick by him. She should or she would, because, man, it's 54 years. Like, exactly. Just don't walk out on that kind of marriage. But like, it's funny, a lot of people, years. you know social media, those a lot of people charges would actually are, want her to leave. Yes, those charges are heinous, you know, like yeah. they're, I, I don't know. I mean, it's, it's her decision to make at the end of the day, so I'm not going to say, oh, stay or oh, leave, but we saw what happened with Harvey Weinstein. That girl mm -hmm. was out in, like, two seconds <laughs> when those charges came up. So for her to be stay, that's Camille. Yeah, yeah. It, it says something about her character, but again, it's her decision to make, you know, stay, leave, it, it's her decision to make, and I guess she's, she's, she's staying. Yeah. yeah, yeah. She's staying. <laughs> she doesn't want to throw away 54 years just like that, I mean. Yeah. They're old already. Mm. Yeah. Okay, so a quick catch up on some other trending stories you can check out. 
Mayor Cohen's latest celebrity to be harassed by men of special anti-robbery squad, also known as SARS, after they disrupted his interview. Saudi Arabia has been trending after they were thrashed five goals to nil by World Cup host Russia. And judge rejects Tara Mari's motion for a restraining order against 50 Cent. Yeah. Okay, so which, which should we talk about first? Oh, let's talk about, oh, right, oh, the let's first game. Let's talk about the top. Mayoko. Mayoko. Okay. Yeah. How, I, I don't understand. Do, how, do they have a hit list, like SARS? Because they seem to be going <laughs> after a new musician or entertainer yeah. every day. And I don't, I don't really understand. How are they, how is it even possible to keep meeting up with entertainers you know, and think, harassing them? I think they, I think they're doing a lot of, damage everywhere but we're only hearing about the entertainers because they're sure. entertainers yeah i saw something this was on um, ozumba in vi these guys got i don't know if it was sars but they were uniformed men and they got down from a van and got into two cars like they flagged two cars down these cars were wow. right in front of me and then they just got into the car they told the people in the front seat to go to the back so i I don't understand how this works, you know, I don't, it's, we don't understand yeah. and we really would like clarity, but Maya yeah. Kuhn going through this. Yeah, he actually, how we found out was that he tweeted, he said, oh, may you, may none of you be a victim of um, harassment from, from SARS, SARS today, oh, wow. amen. Is that what we're praying against now? It's, it's, it's like, so we're adding that to our prayer points. Yeah. <laughs> it's like, they are now like a virus in the society, like right. yeah. everybody is complaining about SARS, like there's nobody that is left out. I even yeah. watched a video on, online, like um, I think it was two days ago, where they were beating up a young man on the road and people couldn't do anything. Wow. Yeah, like people are just passing, true. taking like pictures and videos and all that, and that was it. It's Nobody come much. out to do anything. It's, yeah. it's too it's much. It's too much. It's too it's much. Too but much. let's talk about Russia and Saudi Arabia. <laughs> I feel like that was a very uneven yeah. match. Yeah, we were talking about this. <laughs> yes. They were probably fasting. They yes. said fasting. So they don't <laughs> no, have that no, much energy. No, don't say fasting. They are done. No, but, they no, done they're today. done today. They were fasting yesterday. So are, we, are you trying to say that the fasting was the reason why they were thrashed 5 0? No, well, yes, I, think I, it I am. It plays a part yes. to an extent. Because Russians had like steak for breakfast and <laughs> <laughs> God knows what they had for lunch. And then they came out to play. And these guys have not eaten all day. And they could have been matched with another team in their group. Yeah, no, another day. Exactly. Okay. They did not have to play Saudi Arabia yesterday, in my opinion. And those five goals were painful to watch. They're painful to watch, painful. I tell you. It's five. Like, I, I, like, it's just like they came there for nothing. But yeah. let's just hope that the next match, which already are done fasting, they can redeem themselves. They would have enough food in their bellies to actually play well. <laughs> yeah. And did that, you see the, is it Prince of Saudi Arabia and yes, the president and of Putin? They were like just, yeah. yeah. We said, we joked, we said they're probably talking about oil, oil at this oil point. Deals. <laughs> <laughs> And yeah. Tierra Marie, um, yeah. she, was she and 50. This, it's actually quite sad because it was um, an image of her mm -hmm. with her then boyfriend mm -hmm. and she had, you know, stuff on her face. On her face. She, was, she was in an act, <laughs> a, a sexual act. And oh. um, yeah, 50 Cent actually posted it and she wanted a restraining order against him so that he wouldn't be able to continue to talk about it and post uh, it and things yeah. like that. But the judge actually just kind of like threw it out and said yeah. that no, that's not common fair. sense would, yeah, she just said that 50 Cent probably will not um, repost it. He's not allowed to repost it, but he probably wouldn't anyway. Well, the judge anyway. said that like, um, there's no evidence that the, the photo is like, you know, that 50 Cent is involved in the photo. Like she doesn't have any, you know, proof to say, okay, 50 was part of it and stuff like that, but... No, he's not part he's of not it. Part he's not part of, of it, but... It. He I mean, reposted the picture. Yeah, so she, she said that he's, he probably won't post it again anyway, so... But the judge rejected it, so I don't know how she yeah, would go about so it. Yeah, she, so she, 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 she doesn't have a restraining yeah. order against I'm not happy with that, though, because he, he's in a, in a position of power, you yes, know? And a lot of, he has a lot of, exactly, a lot of influence. Yeah. If he's harassing somebody or bullying someone, which is what it seems like he's doing... No, he just, he was making fun of her, which well, wasn't Which nice, is bullying. But, no, he was, he, was, he was making fun of the situation. You know, he was I don't think he was bullying. I think it's more of just the fact that, you know, this is sensitive. This is very sensitive. Yeah. And it's an image of someone in a manner in which they don't, yes, yeah. don't yeah. want to be seen. And you're posting it. Everybody knows that 50 Cent is the most petty. He's a bully. He's a bully. You know, he's so petty. Yes. He's so he's ridiculous. petty. That's the word. Yeah, like... he's very petty. He's, he's so childish. Bully. It's ridiculous. Yeah. He's always like up in the morning, crack of dawn, Just talking... dragging someone. I remember when he was dragging Empire the entire show. Yeah. Even like Floyd. He, he fell yeah. out with Floyd Mayweather. He's always got someone. A, he's a kid. He's dragging yeah, he'll everybody. get over it. She, she, he, he, he'll, he'll, he will, I'm sure he won't. We're sorry. We apologize on his behalf, Tierra. <laughs> yeah. And anyway, what's our photo of the day? Okay, photo of the day is that of Meghan and the Queen on their first solo outing together. Yes, we can see how much fun they're having. Like you said earlier, 
She's dropping her flows on the queen and she's really yeah. enjoying it. She's really having fun. You can see the smile on the yeah. queen's face. The queen I'm never is genuinely the... happy. Yeah, I've never she's actually happy. seen the queen smile like this before, I tell like you. ever. Even ever. her Christmas speeches, <laughs> her Christmas address to the nation. I've never seen her this happy. She seems so happy, like genuinely happy. Yeah. And that's that Megan Sparkle mm. working there. Mm. Yeah, rhymes, the Markle rhymes. Sparkle. The Markle Sparkle. <laughs> yes. So well, is, is it safe to say that she could end up being the queen's favorite? Um, well, I, 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 we, don't, we don't know. I don't, we don't know what Kate has up her sleeves. Yeah, true, well, true. thank you, Ikena. <laughs> Never a dull right. moment on what's trending. When we return, Ugo of 1407 Style will be joining us. Don't go away.